What is going on everyone? This is Double Face coming at you with a little bit of gameplay from Modern Warfare 3. Uh, I'm using the Barrett on Dome, which, you know, is not the best idea, but uh, sometimes you just gotta make it work. And if you notice, the beginning of the game is kinda slow. Um, make some, I made a big mistake there. I was trying to see over that, didn't see the guy there, but you know what? Get the F out of there. You're gonna snipe against me. That, uh, oh, look at random grenade. But, yeah, it starts out slow, and then I run on a high kill streak and one of the, um, H6 Overwatch is my final kill streak, so you know, taking a risk because you know I'm not I'm not MLG like that. But anyway, it turns out to be a pretty good game. Um, it's a little slow, just, just go with it. It's kind of one of those situations where it's like you know if you stick with it, you can actually pull out a really good game in the end. Don't know how I missed that, but anyway. So um, you know I've been watching Netflix like I do. It's just one of those things that you do. You just watch Netflix. If you have it, you watch it, especially on your PS3 or your Xbox or your Wii or whatever you be doing with it. Even on your computer, you got to be watching Netflix because that, that stuff is very good. <laughs> uh, but something that I watched recently was uh, Firefly. Now, if any of you don't know what Firefly w was, unfortunately was, it uh, was a TV show on the Sci-Fi channel that was awesome. Uh, it starred Nathan Fillion. And some other people. I, you know, I'm blanking on the names of them. Um, I don't know why, because the the pilot of the ship is hilarious. I, I liked him in A Knight's Town, you know. But anyway, I'm not gonna go into actors or anything because I completely forgot their names. But anyway, it's an awesome show. It's um, I'm like a westerny type sci-fi show. Uh, basically like space cowboys <laughs> or outlaws, bandits, whatever you want to say. Uh, but it's awesome. It's hilarious and it's awesome. But, like everything awesome in the world, every good TV show has to get cancelled. They have the shit, oh, sorry, they have the stuff, oh come on, it's crap. They have crap like the Real Housewives series that goes through every single freaking state. It's probably going to span different countries, soon we're going to have the Real Housewives of China, New Hampshire, whatever. It's gonna go everywhere. It's gonna be ridiculous. It's never gonna stop, and it's just stupid. I mean, it's the stupidest. I mean, I've watched stuff like that. I'm like, oh gosh, this is. Uh, it's horrible. That doesn't get canceled. Jersey Shore not canceled. Not some inane stuff right there. I mean, this was an awesome show. Why did it get canceled? It's just one of those things. I remember I watched Titus got canceled, and you know, some of you youngins may not know Family Guy. I th I'm pretty sure Family Guy got cancelled from the Fox Network and then um, Adult Swim picked it up and they started making new shows out of that. I know that's that's exactly what happened with Futurama. Futurama got cancelled and it was cancelled for a long time. When I was a young kid, when I was like 13 or something, and I used to watch that on Fox and I'd be like, yeah, Futurama's awesome! And then they cancelled it and then as a kid I was like, oh, Adult Swim, which is on Cartoon Network uh, late night, started playing it. I'm like, this is awesome, I love it, oh my god. And then they started play making new episodes of that. Why can't they do that with, with Firefly? And But why do they have to cancel those shows in the first place? I don't see why they do bad. They don't seem like they would do bad. Uh, what was one of those new ones? Uh, on Sci-Fi, it was Caprica, which was kind of like a spinoff. Ah, this is such a stupid spun. It was a spinoff of uh, Battlestar Galactica. And, uh, like a prequel of everything that happened. And, you know, it really seemed like that was really popular. And then I'm pretty sure that got canceled before the end of it, too. So I'm really just like, where do they get their information of whether a show should be canceled or not? I mean, is there, like, some, like, that was a horrible shot. Some, like, census group or something? Like, who, who, what are these people that decide what, what's good enough to say on TV? Like, really, like... I mean, I guess it makes sense when you have like people like Justin Bieber being like such an awesome pop star, everyone loves him. Oh my God! Oh, Justin Bieber! Oh my God, he's Justin Bieber! But um, yeah, it's like I guess it's that kind of the same situation where you know you have immature people who you know conform basically. They follow the the trends of the world, and I guess it was cool to think that was. <laughs> This, this little series right here, I like get super lucky. I missed that guy. I went to like panic knife him or something and I stabbed the guy in front of him, jumped over him. He didn't know where I was and I killed him. I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Um, so a little bit of luck, you know. That's, what it, that's really what it takes, you know. Sometimes you just get really lucky and you're like, yeah, wrecked. But what was he even talking about? <laughs> TV shows. It just, I guess it's, you know, the, all, the, um, this group of young kids, you know, young people, uh, there's just so many of them that they basically, they they take over everything, 
and it basically is up to them whether things stay or don't. I don't know. I mean, Sci-Fi Channel has had a really bad track record um, with stuff like that, I guess. You know, the made-for-sci-fi movies are complete crap. You know, sometimes they're fun to watch, but for the most part, a cool odd feed. Most of the part, they're not too bad. Or, no, they're, most of the part, they're bad. <laughs> There's not always good ones on there. Uh, but the TV shows, the sci-fi exclusives of TV, TV shows, are always very, 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 very cool. Um, I guarantee you that looked more legitimate in <laughs> live than on theater mode. It looked like I was, like, hacking. But, yeah. <sighs> Sad day. I, I just been missing that show. It was really, really, really fun. Uh, I enjoyed watching it. I hate that it went off air and I enjoyed watching it a second time so it must have been a really good show but if you guys you know have experienced this what are some TV shows that you really like that got cancelled or what are ones that are going to be cancelled or what's a really bad show that you think needs to be cancelled <laughs> guess those two stealth bombers coming in there not for you suckers but yeah if you if you have anything what's a, what's a bad show that you wish got cancelled and what's a good show that you wish stayed on air <laughs> anyway hope you guys enjoyed this it was like a 30 oh yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna wait I'm gonna wait till the score comes up real quick uh, it was a 34 and 10 with 3 assists with the bear at 50 kill on dome alright hope you guys enjoyed this is double up face on out saying good night and good fight don't forget to like favorite and subscribe what up